heard from our two speakers, but two points that I hope will be useful to you and to our friends in Pakistan and the region in understanding where America may go and what Pakistan may want to do about it. So it'll be very forward looking. I won't relitigate the issues of the past. I'll try to contribute to an understanding of how we will deal with things in the future. First of all, I commend the focus on geoeconomics uh, that comes from the minister. We heard yesterday from uh, even from the prime minister and from his advisor. The geoeconomic effort is an effort that I choose to interpret as a way to deal with these times that are uncertain to try to understand in which ways diplomacy can work in a constructive way, in a new way, to try to get past some of the constraints we've had in the past. I think one of the problems is looking at the two points that I want to make. I'll start with, with uh, the question of how the Americans are looking uh, at the world in this period, and then turn again to Pakistan. And I am, I am not in the American diplomatic service, I'm retired. And as all of you know, the definition of a diplomat is someone who will do everything for his country except live there, right? Um, I, I no longer live in the United States. And so I'm giving you a ins set of insights that will come from my patriotism and 